All right, so I'm back in this city for the first time in quite a while. Let's see. There's some things I was supposed to trade in, wasn't there? Oh, here she, she has the climbing axe. Gilda's lost axe. Did she give me a power spark? What power spark is, what is she talking about? It says I have two power sparks now. I don't know what to do with them now. Uh-oh. Wow, that was pointless. No one went there and came back in a long time. Well, thanks for that tidbit. Damn, I'm smashing people's mailboxes. I didn't even know I could do that before. It's kind of fucked up. Um, alright, I'm supposed to go back, right? Right, I gotta talk to the telephone, I gotta see what else new stuff I can buy. It's Goofy! Freaking robot Goofy. Oh, I can't hit the mailbox. All right, going to be into Mean Street. Going back to Mean Street. The Mean Street Posse. Oh, I have to actually, I really have to go back this way? Ah, oh, shit. What the hell, it's beating the crap out of me. <laughs> Jump right on that pin. to Mean Street. What do I have to trade in here? I'm trying to think. The phone. That oh, I didn't talk to the phone. Fucking shit. I gotta go back. I was supposed to talk to the phone. And the West Town. I forgot to. Son of a bitch. I forgot that the phone was there. This is so stupid. Why can't you just fucking... Once you go through this, why can't you teleport? Why do you have to keep going back and forth through the, the mirror? This is dumb. Power spark is a reward. Now I have three power sparks. I don't know what they do though. Don't they? Didn't they op uh, activate screens before? So maybe I can go to two completely different worlds now because I did those. I'm supposed to go to future, future town now, right? That's what Oswald said.
Repetitive platforming is so much fun! It is pouring outside. There is a massive rainstorm here, so if the power goes out, <laughs> like earlier this year during the Alan Wake playthrough, you'll know what's going on. Yeah, see, there's other screens I need to activate. Here's Oswald. You gotta get to the rocket in Tomorrow City, but there's a problem. The projector screen doesn't work. Gremlin Marcus is trying to get him going. Again. Heroes don't need luck, right? <laughs> Alright. First, I want to see if there's anything new I can buy. Where are those stores? It's the ice cream parlor. Let's see if there's anything new at the ice cream parlor. The, uh, the deluxe sundae, maybe? It's probably nothing new. Nope. Nothing new. How about the item shop? It's over here, right? <coughs> I don't understand what these emblems are for. What the hell? A power spark. I could buy one? I'm gonna buy one, I think. Oh, a lot of stuff got unlocked. Alright, I bought a power spark. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can buy another one for a hundred. So they get more expensive over time. Why would I want to buy these emblems? It doesn't explain what they are. I'll buy one. I don't know what it does, though. There, I bought some junk. I don't know what it's supposed to do, though. I have all this money. I'm like, what am I supposed to do with the money? I found that key, remember? I still have that key I found in the manhole. I don't know what that's for. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna need more power sparks to get the projector screen to Tomorrow City repaired. More of the power sparks have been following people all around Main Street. You should try asking around see if you can recover them. I think five power sparks should do the trick. Do you think you can handle it? Alright, I need one more. I could go buy one. I'm just gonna buy it for now. I don't feel like doing side missions. <laughs> What were they thinking when they made these sound effects? Uh -uh. Oh, another one for 150? I'll buy that. See, they go up by 50 every time you buy one. Uh -uh. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh See if the private eye has anything new to say. Probably not. Someone took one of the books from my office. I can't leave my agency unattended, particularly when there's a thief about. Would you track it down? I'd very much appreciate it. Oh, look, there's footprints. Ah. Huh. 
That's interesting. Now wait a minute, Horace is a detective, but he sends me to do detective work. What an asshole. Here they go, footprints, footprints, footprints. Up the building? How do I get up there? I've been up there before. I don't want to talk to them. I, I can't jump because this fucking bitch is standing there. Oh, come on, you stupid fucking turds. Out of my way. How did I get up there before? Did I jump from across the street? No, that's too far. I climbed up here somehow. I swear there was a hole. Huh. I don't know. Maybe from the other side here? Aha, that's what it was. Alright, the feet go up the side of the building here, see? Come on, Mickey, get the fuck up there, you idiot. There he is, there's the guy who has the book. He's on top of the building dancing, look at him. What a dick. Here we go. Oh, you didn't follow me, did you? This book? Oh, this isn't Horace's book. It just looks similar. You got no proof. No hard evidence it was me. Look, you could run around and do a bunch of detective work, or you could buy this other book I have that's like the one you're looking for. Only 50 e-tickets. Do you want to buy the book? No. Oh, I have to buy it? Oh, shit. All right, I'll buy it. Alright, so he made me pay for the book, because basically he says I have no hard evidence, even though I have footprints leading straight to him, so it makes no sense. Alright, he gives me a power spark, so I have seven power sparks. Anything else to say? The dog from Great... Oh, here you go. If you're heading to Tomorrow City, could you look for some clues? Dog tags would be a huge break. Okay. So you have to talk to everyone in the town so I can find all these power sparks, I guess, later on. Anyone else over here? No, everyone's gone. Look. They kind of vanished. What about the woman in the museum? What does she have to say? <laughs> and no. Absolutely no reason to do that. 